News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Good morning, everyone. Basil Chapman here for the 9 o'clock Tiger Financial News Network market update. Dow futures are up 51 uh, at this 9, 9 a.m. Eastern time period. We're looking at Dow futures up 52 at 34,778. Uh, this is, uh, for those of you who use Chapman Wave methodology, this is leg D. This is where you've got to become a little bit cautious to see what happens next. But all the technicals are very strong. And except in this case, the YM on balance volume still has a it's still a little bit weak, so that gives you room to go to the upside. But in the meantime, I think that we're going to see a fairly narrow trading day. Looking at the E mini, the ES, that's up 11 at 44.82, just under yesterday's high. Uh, here again, all the technicals are very good, but both in the Dow and so far the S and P, that in their case, the on balance volume. Um, is different. The e-mini on balance volume is extremely high, but this is very interesting because the cash Dow, and I'm not sure why this is happening. Uh, yes, also same thing. So let's look at the uh, QQQ, which is the NDX 100 trading vehicle right now, up a dollar fifty-two, three seventy-one point seventy-eight, and that is at I think a new recovery high. Yes, it is, just by one penny so far. But you've got to go to the actual price from the 9.30 time frame. So at this point, we're real close to that high. The weekly charts had a beautiful return to the, the high that was made back in April. And all the technicals are strong. So that gives you very strong support for the next week in the 360s. Looking at the IWM, which is the Russell 2000, it's come on very nicely today. It's up 28 cents at 187.72. So lagging the other. So it could have played catch up. Well, if it starts to trade next week in the 192 or higher area, that's going to be really strong. Meantime, it's got 183 support. It's uh, and that's it. It's trying to play catch up to the others. If you're looking at gold, gold is, uh, it was up strongly yesterday. It was up more today. It's up four right now at 1974. Held the 200 period moving average, trying to bounce off that. That's 1939's uh, key support in that particular instance. Looking at the uh, bonds, I didn't do bonds before. I should do it right now. Bonds are trading down 630 seconds at 127 and 1930 seconds. Just stuck in a range. I've been saying that yields are going to be stuck in a range for a while. And I think that that's so far the case. And looking at crude oil, this is going to be important. Crude oil is running a little bit at up 49 cents, but it's still stuck in the rain. Stay tuned for Tommy O'Brien. Uh, market kickoff coming up next. Great programming at TFNN. Have a wonderful long weekend. Basil Chapman signing.